God, where am I? How? What did I do to deserve this? I didn't think. Oh my God. Oh. It's kind of hot in here. Okay, now. Is there AC in here? <laughs> I guess not. Well, I guess. <laughs> oh, there's some scary skeletons in here. Oh. Curse you, Chad Benzowitz. This is your fault. Oh, if I ever get back to Earth. Oh, what I do to that man. This is his fault. Fucking company. His I didn't think it was true when they said filmmakers go to hell, but I guess it makes sense. I guess it makes some fucking sense, doesn't it? All the work we do. Oh, man. We do teach, don't we? Children learn everything they know from movies. So I guess if God doesn't like the movie, then here I am. It's all my fucking fault. False. Chad Benzowitz hired me. I was his employee. So it's, I, I hope, I hope you die soon so you can meet me in hell. Time I was Freddy the fucking intern. Now I'm Freddy Fibula Hunter, and I'm going to kill Chad Benzowitz and steal his fucking fibula. <laughs> I was just typing the script for an next. <laughs> Sponsored by Old Spice. Misunderstanding. How? See. We're in hell, Chad. We're in H E double hockey sticks. Listen, H -E -L -L. I know. H E L L. Listen, I know how to get out. Satan's crib. Satan's listen, crib. Listen up. Listen up. The okay. devil. All 
Oi! Okay, yeah, this is entirely my fault, but right. I just wanted to expand the Joel and Jack franchise, but then the, the maniac takes my jugulars. The Jill and Jack franchise. Yes. It's always about Jill and Jack. You do realize what you've done tonight. Because of it's you have caused this. You have put us into eternal damnation because of the Jill and Jack franchise. How do you it was A24's fault for hiring me in the first place, but now I need their help more than ever. I will help you A return to her. A24! I haven't heard. The Where is he? Sound of oh. Listen, he's still roaming the earth. You and I are in hell. However, he's still there. How do you the demon. Is he here with us? No, he's on earth. We need to go Where back to on earth. The, when there's a will, there's a way. To the left. Production, an art film called Super Wannabe Gangster. It is the frattiest movie that will ever be made. Is it your movie? Yes. Let's get back to it. I need A24's help. Alright, let's read. Sorry, I messed up again. We have to redo it. Okay. Okay, there's a hidden ladder. Take you to A24. Wait, I don't. How did we get out of the hell? There's a, a fucking ladder? Yes. Chad, how'd you know? I've been there many times. Holy shit. Wow. It's a, a lot to. Um. Chad, it's been like 30 minutes. Come on. Shut up, woman. I am preparing. Okay. <clears throat> Chad? Chad, can I come in? I am ready. Okay. I must dress up and. Why do you? Why do you? Why are you dressing up? What's going on? I must dress up in my Sunday best. <clears throat> okay. <sighs> Sunday my best. Is still recovering. That 
Demon. Yeah, I'll say. Mm. I'm ready. <clears throat> All right, Chad. It's time. I even grew back my luscious locks for this one moment. Wow. 30 minutes. All right. Well, how are we gonna find the demon? Come forth, demon. I know you're in here. Are you sure this works? Yes. Okay. Spin around. Counterclockwise. <laughs> Do it at about two rounds per second. One, two, stop. Okay. Spin the clockwise one time. Oh, come on. Chad, are you sure about this? Yes. All right. Step on me. <laughs> <laughs> My fragile ribs. Your fragile I'm ribs. I'm 63 years old. 63? Yeah. I need my glasses to hide my crow's feet. 63? How long? Bring is my it glasses been? to a formal meeting for nothing. I get. I Why get didn't me. the demon come? What's. What's going on? Where am I? It worked. I'm not, I'm not. What's, what's happening? I didn't think it would work. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? What do you, what do you, what do you mean? What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? I'm not moving. I'm not, I'm not doing this on my own. Look, I'm just a movie producer, I... I'm not... I'm just... It was just a reference to Satan's birthday. Did you ever see Satan's birthday party? What, what is that, a, a movie you directed? Yeah, Satan's birthday bash. Oh, of course, of course you directed Satan's birthday bash. Now explain yeah. to me what's going on, please. No, I don't know what's going on. I was, what? What? I was just trying to be funny. <laughs> I, was just, I was just fooling around. When is it coming, Chad? It's not coming. <laughs> Unacceptable! Them. I can't. I've really shit my whole life. Well, the thing is, buddy... I must make... Super wannabe gangsta. That's the fucking Chad Benzowitz. That's the Chad Benzowitz that I met. That I baked this whole fucking thing into. Yes! Yes, Chad, we're gonna make Super Wanna be gangsta. And you're gonna do it. 
Freddy Fabio to ambush me, okay? I was typing the script for Super Wannabe Gangsta, and he hammered me in the fibula. I still have a limp in this butt. Chad, Freddy Fibula was one fucking guy. One intern that laid comatose for five years. Do you have any idea the stamina? His body- You're really one old fucking bastard. Oh my god. We're gonna make Super Wannabe Gangsta and it's going to be just as good as Jackie- as <laughs> Jill and Jack. No. Is, uh, I didn't say a number, Chad. This is gonna no. be better than the original. No, no, no. And you wanna know why? You don't believe me, but you wanna know why? <laughs> oh. I give you the energy of a boy. <laughs> Once more, Chad, let it revive. Oh. Spin around. Take three ups this time. <laughs> Slide to the left. Slide to the right. Press crouch. Now go chop oh. all real smooth. Hold up, give me a breath. I'm not used to breathing. Did I ask for a breath or did I ask for a cha cha real smooth? I'm not used to an real smooth. oxygen. Okay. Altitude sickness. Oh yeah. <laughs> That's right. Yes, that sounds good. You know, riding. Hey, that was too close to my face. I have crow's feet. Crow's feet. Oh wait, I don't have it anymore. Never mind. But I look good in glasses. Oh fuck. You see, riding. Screenwriting is an art. It's a very important one. Without it, you wouldn't have your most beloved movies, such as Jill and Jack 9, Swing the Vine. Oh yeah, I believe... I believe, um... The most popular one, Jill and Jack 6, Pick Up Sticks. That one won an award, I can't remember which one. Yeah, that looks good. You see that? This is writing. Now I just gotta edit it. Okay. Oh yeah, there's this one scene in Super Wannabe Gangsta where... <clears throat> the boys run out of milk, so they go to the nearest farm, and they gotta do it themselves. This is peak comedy right here. They milk the cow. But, um, obviously they're incompetent at it, so... Now, Ch Chadwick, if you, if, you, if you may mind, if you, if you don't <coughs> mind if I interject, now, it's a real honor to have you here, but, um, well, you know, all, all the folks at home were wondering, um, really, what, what, what goes into the mind of ma making something like Jill and Jack 6 pick up sticks, you know? Truly a seminal piece of its genre, I mean, what goes through your mind as you just, as you get the blank canvas and you just begin to put words on it? How, could you, could you walk us through a day in your mind like that? Well, I just think, what do people think is funny? Oh, people will love this. A scene where... A scene where Jill poops out 17 bricks into the toilet, flushes it down. Oh yeah. People will love that. People love my movies. Everyone loves my stuff. Now, Chadwick. Everybody um, loves me. There, there was recent controversy with the Academy on your nomination after your film. Um, it was uh, Jill and Jack Nine. It, what, what, remind me, Jill and Jack Nine. It was. Uh, well, well, regardless of the title, I. Um, 
many of your directing credentials were questioned or brought up into the spotlight after Jill and Jack Nine was submitted to several scatological festivals. Now, what do you have to say about those who think that your films are, well, no good than doo-doo? Oh, those pretentious critics. Critics are dumb. Critics don't know what's best for them. The people should decide. Critics are just mad that they can't direct like me. They're mad. Thank you so much, Tyler. And remember that scene from, uh, what was it? Would you like to phone a friend? You in the back. What? What movie was it? Jill and Jack Nine. Rip. Really? I thought the it was. The scene where, um, with the you know. The, I thought it was the, Fruit uh, Loops. Yeah. Fruit Loops, maybe. Oh, of course it was Fruit Loops because it was the the fruity. Yeah, fruity. The, the gay, the gay guys. The yeah, gay the men. fruity guys. Yeah, the fruity guys, the gay men. Yes, yeah, the... so, so several of the Jill and Jack films have aged rather interestingly. Well, I, mean, I think I think that they have um, aged fine. You know, I think there's too much PC culture. Can someone escort um, this fucking? No, never. There's too much PC uh, culture going on. You know, you can't do anything anymore. You can't say anything anymore. You know, it's it's ridiculous. You can't say anything anymore without people getting angry at you. Um, I think it's, um, you know, I love homosexuals. I think they're great. And I have a lot of friends who are homosexuals. Um, but I still think it's funny, you know, to joke around. And I think it was funny when, you know, they um, had that scene in uh, Fruit Loops uh, where, um, you know. Oh, it was called Fruit My Loop. Fruit My Loop, sorry. Um, in Fruit My Loop when, um, you know, you had the, the two gay men and um, the guy went up to them and went, Ew. Ew. You know, like it was supposed to be funny. It was supposed to be funny. It was. It still is. Yeah. It was. It was just a. You know. It was comedy. It was. It was a joke. Um. I don't see what's wrong with comedy. I don't see what's wrong with getting laughed. That's my thing. Now, Chadwick. Um. After all the criticism of your fan, uh, over here, you know, they truly. They, 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 they really sum up a lot of the criticism that your films have been seeing in the public eye recently now. What, what, what parting words before this television program ends do you have for all of the critics that simply say that your films could not exist in this post-woke world? Say hello to Super Wannabe Gangsta.